Clutter. Brisbane is currently in a three-day lockdown and I don't know what to do with myself <laughs> so I will be cleaning out my closet it's just over here and also my chest of drawers which are over here and there is a lot to go through I have the massive IKEA dresser and a massive wardrobe with so much stuff in it so many clothes and just stuff that I don't need I'm hoping I'll get rid of a lot of stuff. I don't know though. So we will have to see. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave a like and a comment down below and let's just get into the video. This is me, very raw, no makeup. I might just open this so there's no glare. To be completely honest with you, I don't do well in lockdowns. I get into a bit of a funk. And I don't enjoy it. I love being out of the house, socializing with people. So decluttering and getting control over the things in my life that I can control is probably the easiest way that I can feel a little bit better. Don't mind the fan. It is hot. My room gets really hot. I've already decluttered downstairs, cleaned out the fridge, kind of redid the, reorganized the pantry a little bit. And now I'm onto my closet. As you can see, it is chock a block. Like this little bit, it's like that the whole way across. So, probably to start, I'll just give you a bit of a rundown of the closet. So, on this side, I probably, I've got this IKEA, what do you call it? Like a cube set. And it just has a little bit of decor, a little bit more decor. There's just a lot of stuff up here. But I can get rid of too many Pandora bags and then following down my work bag and then in here is just some of those Kmart tubs that I love I've got four of them up here so two there a little bit of a, oh my, a little bit of decor in the middle which I will tell you about and then two more there and there's a little bit of clutter over there then over this side this is a built-in I would love to rip it out when I redo my room a little bit at the end of the year but just so I can get some more like hanging space but I don't know what I would do with all of this so maybe 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 not um I've got my makeup up here this is like my vanity station this is great from Luvo um all of this stuff I would love to organize that a little bit better then I've got some more baskets and little containers, my travel bag is back there, and then some more bags, just clutter, some more camera stuff, school stuff, and then more camera stuff down there. So it is a task. Don't really know what I'm going to start with. Probably the clothes because I think it'll be the easiest. Not quite sure why I've decided that it will be the easy e that it will be the easiest, but I think it will be. I've literally got so many clothes and so many clothes over here that I've offloaded stuff into my sister's room, but I have a few ideas and things that I'm going to do. So I think where I'm going to start, I'm just going to pull it all out, throw it on my bed and then we'll go from there. that I know I've worn recently, that I know I will continue to wear. We'll go. <laughs> so, I've got these button downs. These two are really nice. 
It's probably about a year old or almost a year old. This is like a couple months old and this is a few years old. Um, can't say I've worn it recently. Don't think I'm going to wear it. Okay, so I'm going to keep all of these. If I don't wear the green one in the next two months, then it will go. That's kind of my rule of thumb when I'm doing this stuff. If I don't wear it in the next two months, then it goes. I want to fold these up. So I'm not going to hang them in there yet. I think I might just put them on the floor. It's clean, don't worry, I won't ruin the white. But all of these are super nice. I know I'll keep these ones. The only one I think I would get rid of is the yellow one. Um, just because that mustardy yellow isn't quite my style anymore. But all the rest are here to stay. She thick. She thick. well I just need to lose some arm fat this is just another cute little blouse I really like it and sports girl um, some they're all sports girl these are just from the last couple of years again really like them nothing wrong with them just they're summer so I haven't worn them This is pretty much brand new. I love it. It's staying. This one, I don't know. I think it could be cute for summer. It's just, it's a bit short on me. Like, it looks like it would be, like, a bit longer. It's just not really. We'll try it. We'll try it. Now, these ones, great for summer. Love them. Just for around the house, they're great. And these ones also super cute this is a good for the beach this one's a long sleeve this is just from Kmart but it's super comfy haven't worn it too much but again it's winter these are all staying these are my like baby doll t-shirt dresses I guess it's all super cute all love them and this one's definitely staying it's pretty much brand new <laughs> these two however I have really love them both i've had them for a really long time they just don't quite fit me anymore and i don't want to get rid of them because they're really expensive pieces um i mean at least for me like i don't want to repurchase them and they're just super duper cute so and it's literally just because of my boobs that they don't fit which is the hardest part about having big boobs is that you, I, over the last few years, have had just to get rid of so much stuff because it doesn't fit over my boobs. And it's really hard. <laughs> like mentally, it's really difficult. These dresses, all pretty new, all great dresses. Definitely staying. Oh, this didn't work. <laughs> I wear them all pretty frequently. They will stay. I've just got my school blazer, no fun, a puffer, a denim jacket, and a teddy bear jacket. Just staples, really. I don't know who that does, but that just really opened things up. In fact, these aren't that thick. There's only a few pieces, but it was really all the sweaters that I took out that just opened it all up but hopefully we can clear out the drawers and make room for them because if I can't do that then they're gonna have to go back in there so apparently I have no footage from cleaning this bad boy out this is editing you see but I will just show you a few of the drawers that I did clean out. Not that you have a before. Just because they will look a lot better. 
Um, so this is my skirt pant drawer. I've got all my denim, some workout gear, some shorts, and then all my skirts. Got rid of a few of these. Got rid of a lot of denim. It's all over there. There was a much bigger pile, but um, that's been given to my sister and friends already. <laughs> and then down here, I'm just going to pause. I'm on Snapchat recording this. <laughs> down here I've got all of my sweaters that I was telling you about that I moved it looks so nice I love the color scheme mine is like if you took out that like oh it's so pretty it's like oh it's gorgeous um I did tidy up this one as well I've got a few more just in the wash um this one is still kind of a little bit of a mess but that's fine I didn't tidy the sock drawer but as you can see it's stuck so it doesn't really matter um, this one is kind of just random stuff didn't do that one but I did tidy up this one managed to fit all of my tog swimmers bathers whatever you want to call them in there um some like crop tops and stuff and just some extra bras yeah <laughs> other thing that was cut out is I cleaned up all of these bins as you can see there's some more stuff to donate up there um tidied up this one got rid of a few things tidied up those ones this just has a little bit of decor um that stuff just has i think this one has photos and this one has like flashcards. and then over here i tidied up this bag one again and tidied up this one and culled a lot of these bags i haven't had a chance to tackle this but that might be a this weekend thing. So stay tuned for the lockdown vlog that is coming because I can tackle that then. <laughs> I'm not too stressed, but I did have that universal bag full of pajamas. That's full of more stuff that's just old and can go to the bin. This one's full of all the bags I'm getting. I did give a bunch of sweaters and stuff to my sister. And then that was my picture frame that broke. And then that one's got even more clothes in it to give to some friends. But yeah, my picture frame broke. I'm really sad. It was the wind. Um, but yes, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more of this, I will definitely make it because organization is like my favorite thing on the planet. I hope you guys are staying safe. Australia is in a really messy place with COVID right now. Um, stay safe, wear your masks, have fun, and I will.